So I wanted to do a quick video on branding. So a lot of really small business owners, entrepreneurs, etc., they they're going to have to address the subject of branding with their business at some point. And many that I've run into over the course of the last 12, 13 years have approached it as branding was more <clears throat> of a tangible, a physical manifestation, i.e. It was the logo. It was the signage on the front of the building. And with me personally, I see it differently. The way that I look at branding has always been the emotion that you, your corporate entity, inspires within your audience, your customers, etc. People that people, that's the key. People that interact with your corporate entity, that is in my mind, that's the brand. Because what branding does is the following. Here's what branding is. Branding is getting married. Okay. Got it? Yeah. And selling is hooking up. Okay. Okay. Like, 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 <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, like, why did I buy these? Not because they cookied me. Right. I'm fascinated by that. It's why I'm winning. Right. I'm branding while everybody else is selling. Hey, I'm Dave Gerhardt. I'm the director of marketing uh, at Drift. And today on Office Hours, we're going to talk about the brand book. Our brand, our brand is something that we think about a lot from a marketing perspective and just from a company perspective. Dave, what is branding to you? Oh man, this is a good question. I didn't prep for this. Um, to me, branding is just like, it's how, it's how the people that don't work at your company feel about your company. Uh, I think we can say it's one thing, but if I go and I just like, you know, emailed somebody that subscribes to our blog or listens to our podcast or watch our video and I said, how would you describe Drift? To me, mm. that is the brand. Uh, and it's so important to us because, especially today, like, there's just a million products out there and there's so much competition that like, just because you have a good product, you're not gonna be able to win somebody's attention. Um, and so by having a brand is just like a, a creating emotional connection with, with the people out there mm -hmm. uh, that are gonna be working with your business. And I think you have to have a strong brand in order to compete today because the way that people buy, if I go to your website and I don't like what I see, I'm gone. And I might even go buy something that's more expensive just because somebody got back to me quicker, it felt like a better experience and that's just, you know, the that's how business works today. All right. I was totally gonna th throw down on some branding talk. And now I realize that I don't have anything I need to say on the topic. Because if you watch Dave, then he broke it down for you. And if you combine that with what Gary V said earlier, then you have a much better understanding. And if, if I could leave you with something, if you're gonna use this information, then you understand that it's the emotion that your brand will elicit. It's going to come more from co building connections with, you know, just random strangers is really what it works out to. Because, you know, you have to get their attention and then you have to keep their attention in order to build that bond, that connection with them, you know, over a long-term relationship. And it's that human at the at the center of it. That's why... I highly recommend that you head over to the Drift blog and the most recent blog post is about the Drift brand book.